The first guitar is 1998 Antonio Marin Montero from Granada. Marin Montero is considered as a leading luthier from Granada and also one of the most important guitar maker in Granada. This beautiful instrument has a spruce top combined with very beautiful Amazonas rosewood. The most important milestone in Marin Montero career was during the 70s. He befriended with Robert Boucher. They built guitars together. They became good friends. Of course, it was a very interesting moment. Marin Montero with his Spanish guitar making background and Robert Boucher with his very particular bracing system. Marin Montero was very inspired also by Robert Boucher bracing system which he's still using until now. Five fan bracing with Boucher bar underneath. Let's take a listen how this guitar sound. The first thing I notice about the guitar is it has a lot of colors. It has very white tonal palette. The trebles are very rich. The basses are providing solid foundation for the instrument. The trebles has a bit bite into it. It has some, I would say, a Spanish, uh, Spanish vibe into it. Even though this guitar is heavily inspired by the French Robert Boucher, I will still consider this guitar as a Spanish guitar. It has the Spanish character and Spanish vibe into it. Let's play something on this guitar. Even though the trebles have bite on it, but still I consider this treble as very romantic sounding. It is very beautiful. Of course, you can also tell that the guitar is well developed since this is from 1998. Because with the spruce guitars, normally it takes some time until they really open up. This spruce guitar has been developed over years. I feel very musical when playing this guitar. It's easy to shape the melody. The melody is not too thick, it's not too thin. It has beautiful bite on it. At the same time, it offers some uh, character or I'll say romanticism. So I will play another song on this guitar. <laughs> The overtone of the trebles are very beautiful.
it has it has very rich overtones but it's still maintaining its clarity and the separation the middle voices are also very alive no wonder why antonio marin montero is considered as a legendary spanish guitar maker <laughs>